How are you? See, where am I standing? Yes, it's a favorite place. Your outside garden. And what can you see here around me? Some are living things and some are non-living things. Yes, we have learned in a previous topic. And what are all this? Plants. Yes, plants are living things. And what do they give us? What is this? Yes, lovely beautiful flowers. And here is a man with a new topic of flowers. Yes, children, see flowers are so colorful and beautiful and they have so sweet fragrance. Now, do you want to know more about flowers? And here we have so many beautiful flowers. And what can you see here? Which flower is this? Yes, it's a sunflower. And why do we call it a sunflower? Do you know why? Because sunflower is a flower which always faces the sun. And that is why it is called a sunflower. Then we have a periwinkle. A beautiful small periwinkle. And here comes a shoe flower. Do you know? We offer this flower to Lord Ganesha. Red shoe flower. Then comes tulip. And here is a national flower. That is lotus. Even this lotus, red lotus, is a favorite flower of goddess Lakshmi. And children, do you know lotus grows in pond? And children, which flower is this? I think you have seen this somewhere. Where? Yes, in a Balmandi garden. What is the name of this flower? It's Champa and it is known as Plumeria in English. It has five petals. Can I say this? It's Champa. And children, Champa has very, very sweet fragrance. Here comes the king of flowers, that is red rose. Children, we then comes Mogra. Here we have marigold. And which flower is this? A flower which looks like a bell? Lily. Lily often looks like bell. Children, what are this? Flowers. As we have learned the topic of flowers, ma'am told you all, God has made flowers and to add beauty in this nature. In the same way, you are also flowers of a family. See the way the flowers are blooming? You also always remain happy, smiling and bloom like flowers. You are a flowers of a Bal Mandir. Children, your man has drawn few flowers. But there are many, many, many different, different types of flowers with pretty different colors. And after going through these flowers, we will learn something more about What do we have first? These incense sticks and garlands. Children, we offer this incense sticks and garland to God. And this incense sticks are also known as agarbatti. And what are these? Talcum powders, different, different flavors. Rose, lily, jasmine. And what do we have next? Soaps. Do you have bath with these? Yes, they have so sweet fragrance. And the next is perfumes. Even they have so sweet fragrance. Yes. And what is this? Rose syrup. You know children, you can uh, mix water or milk and drink this rose syrup. And this is rose water. When you feel hot, you can apply this to your face and these flowers see ma'am has got so many flowers for you now children let's go through the spelling of flowers children after going through different different flowers and things we get from flowers we will be learning the spellings of flowers okay children now which flower is this yes rose let's 
learn the spelling of rose. R O S E rose. R O S E rose. The next is lily. L I L Y lily. L I L Y lily. Then comes sunflower. And as it is a big spelling, we will be splitting the spelling. Say S U N F L O W E R sunflower. Again S U N F L O W E R sunflower. Then is our national flower. L O T U S lotus. L O T U S lotus. Plants. Now, ma'am will teach you all how to write and memorize the spelling of flowers. So, here comes our first flower that is rose. What is the spelling of rose? Come on. R O S E Rose. R O S E Rose. One more time. R O S E Rose. Then we have Lily. Spelling of Lily is L I L Y. Lily. See children, spelling of Lily is L I L Y. L I L Y. Lily. One more time. It's L I L Y. Lily. Then we have sunflower. Spelling of, spelling of sunflower is S U N F L O W E R Sunflower Now we will split the spelling Say S U N F L O W E R Sunflower One more time S U N F L O W E R Sunflower Then comes Lotus the spelling of lotus is L O T U S Lotus L O T U S Lotus One more time L O T U S Lotus Children, after learning about different different flowers, now we will be learning to draw pictures and learn the spelling of flowers. And which was the first flower? Yes, that was rose. So write the spelling of rose. R-O-S-E. Rose. And write five times. To draw the picture of rose, make a jalebi, a curve like three, again a ulta three, and a three again. Make a U curve, slanting lines, and a small cup. Also draw a leaf. And children, as ma'am has told you all, rose is a thorny plant. Make some thorns. So here is rose. Next is lily. L-I-L-Y. Lily. Write five times. To draw a picture of lily, make a U curve, W, then slanting lines, slipping line, slanting line, again a slanting line, Sleeping line, slanting line and slanting line and join with a curve like this. Then a slanting line join with some dots, small curve and slanting line. That's lily. Next is sunflower. S-U-N-F-L-O-W-E-R. Sunflower. To draw a sunflower, make an oval. Slanting lines, opposite slanting lines. And curve, another curve, curve, curves, many curves for patterns. That's curve, 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 curve. Slanting lines 
and a leaf. Then comes lotus. L O T U S. Lotus. To draw a lotus, we'll make a standing triangle joined with a U curve. Then slanting lines curve, slanting lines curve, slanting lines curve, slanting lines curve. And as lotus grows in pond, draw some water, stamp and leaf. So here is our lotus. Children, you have learned so many things in detail about flowers. I hope you can memorize the spelling of flowers and also practice drawing the picture of flowers. And children, one more thing. You all are advised to wash your hands well.